everyone, it's Sarah at Realm Library bringing you another Boredom Busters craft which is just something simple and easy that you can make at home just with everyday items that hopefully you've got at home. Today we're making pom-pom bookmarks. <laughs> Don't they look fantastic? And once you put them in your book they keep your page nice and secure, ready to go. Alright, so to start with you'll need some wool, a fork, whether it's a plastic fork or a metal fork, and yeah, some scissors and a paper clip as well. All right, to start with, you need three pieces of wool that are about a metre long, so about your arm span. And we lay them in the middle prongs of the fork like this. So if you can see that, I've put them in the middle of the fork like that. Okay. Now we start winding the wool round and around the fork this way. All right, so now we're gonna start winding our wool around our fork. So if you put your thumb on the end so you don't lose it like that, and just wind and wind and wind around the fork, um, maybe 40 or 50 times, just depends on how thick and fluffy you want your pom-pom to be. So I'm just going to keep winding round and round. Uh, now I think that should be enough. And then cut that end off. Now the three strands that we had through the fork, we're going to bring up through the middle of the fork the other way and tie it round so we can secure the pom-pom like that in a big double knot like that. So now that we've tied it securely around the pom-pom, we can slide the other pieces of wool off the fork and we just need to cut all of those loops that we had around the fork. So this takes a little bit of time, cutting those loops round and round and round. I think I've got all of them, maybe there's two there. And then the other side around cutting all the loops and then once you've cut all the loops you can trim your pom-pom a little bit some of the the ends might be a little bit uneven so you can trim them all up so your pom-pom looks nice and even so let's trim these bits up here and make it nice and fluffy and those ones there, we'll trim those ones off. Now we have our pom-pom like that. And what we're going to do is plait or braid these three strands, the three long meter pieces. Now the easiest way that I found to do that was to tape your pom-pom to the table and then it holds it securely and it just makes it easier to plait it. So if we do like that and then you can start plaiting and you might need a little bit of help with this you might need an adult's help to plait your pom-pom like this plaiting all the way down keep going and you just need to plait however long that you'd like your bookmark to be all right now that we've finished the plaiting and as i said as long as you'd like to do just tie a knot in the end of your plait or your braid and then you can cut off the excess but just leave yourself a little bit of excess like that and then we can unstick our pom-pom like that now what we're going to make is the bottom now i've just got two pieces of felt but whatever you would like however you'd like to decorate the bottom i've just done a heart shape so I can cut out maybe I'll cut out a triangle shape like this two pieces and cut out a triangle and then we can just glue the two pieces with the excess in the middle like that and glue them down like that and I just put a paper clip while it's gluing I just put a paper clip on it like that to hold it all together. And then 
when it's glued, it will stay on and you've got a lovely pom-pom bookmark to keep your page on your favourite book. I hope you enjoyed that craft and we'll see you next time. Bye.